tool. This is the Works 20 volt, five inch, one handed, battery operated chainsaw. Now if chainsaws frighten you, they should. Uh, I own a couple chainsaws and every spring, I have to take them in for maintenance to have the spark plug removed, have it all tuned up to make sure it's gonna work. And we're at that time of year where we're seeing storms coming through. How many limbs are down in your yard right now, Pat? I have a zillion. Yes. This is absolutely the easiest way to take care of projects around your home and to be self-sufficient. It's a true chainsaw. But because it's battery operated, you don't have to worry about fuel. You don't have to worry about mixing oil and it does the job. It's just a smaller version. It's designed for people who are very uncomfortable with a chainsaw to be able to use a chainsaw. Well, and I think a lot of times chainsaws are very hard to control and intimidating. I, I so, guess. Can we because talk about- Because the theory is, if they're strong enough to uh -huh. cut the limb of a tree, yeah. that's why that's they call grandma. these yeah, things yeah, limbs. You're a great, great- <laughs> Have you point. ever thought about that? Dano, before we jump over to Susan and, and do some fun things, can we talk about everything that comes with it? Okay, you get the apparatus itself. Okay. Again, designed for one-handed operation, which means nothing's near the blade that you don't want near the blade. Here's your blade cover. You get your battery charger and the battery, and then you get a small amount of initial chain oil. Okay. Because uh, you do lubricate a chain so that it'll glide through whatever okay. it is you're cutting. And I think this price is very reasonable at $139.98. It cost me almost 70 bucks to get my chainsaws retuned. Really? Every spring. And I, because I live on a farm, we're always having to cut yeah. something down. Come here, show you okay. how easy this works. I'm not gonna do the One first of our demonstration. Favorite garden friends. Yay. Yes. Yay. Thursday is it, Thursday's our kickoff of Lawn and Garden. Oh, yes. fantastic. So we're giving you a head start. Susan oh. Butterworth is back with us. Yeah, so I just turned it on, and now I'm just going to lean it in. And look how I'm not even pressing hard. I'm just letting it do the work. We're coming through. It's a big, thick, woo! woo. It's gone. Let me... Where'd it go? I was going to pick what, it up Susan, and show you, but it's it gone somewhere. It is now clean. It's right. clean. It's a clean cut. Look at that cut. gorgeous cut. Yeah. It's clean. And, I did it mm -hmm. myself. It's light. And by the way, we do want to mention, whenever you use any chainsaw, you should, of course, always wear safety glasses. Yes. yes. But we're on TV and we think we're special. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, you know, and let me just show you again, okay. because the five inch blade, it's just doing the work. I'm doing it one-handed. I can go anywhere in my yard because it's battery powered. Look I just that. cut it through again, and there it is again. But it's a Look clean, at that. that's a, that's healthy a hardwood. cut instead yes. of tearing through, yes. and then you end up giving your tree or whatever it is disease. Exactly, that is another good point. But as you were saying, and I really have the same situation, um, I just turned it on again. Um, I have so many down limbs. I just cut it again, it was super easy. Look how fast the work is. So whether you have that other big chainsaw, maybe you're gonna say right. to yourself, I don't even need to take it out anymore because I've got this super lightweight chainsaw I can use yeah. anywhere. And, and listen, Paul Bunyan, you're not going, you're not, you're not gonna be taking down a forest of trees. Right. But these are the branches that are big enough yeah. that you know, if you hire a tree service, and I respect what they do for work, yep. but it's expensive. Yeah. Uh, this is self-sufficiency. Yes, exactly. It's a real chainsaw. It's just a five-inch blade. And if you were trying to use a handsaw, what yep. happens to me, right. I don't know about anybody else, but you get halfway through it or three-quarter, and it gets stuck. And then you're ripping at the tree. Uh, and, and I did, I did make a mistake. Yeah. In, fact, yes. in fact, Susan, this is my yeah. fault. Yes, She told me you. this earlier. You, you get the bottle for the chain oil. Yep. But the chain oil does not come with it. Yeah, we okay, just, but you we get that at the store, Yeah, because right? we, can't, we can't ship that. Yes, okay. so but we you just can get put that. a few drops in to show you that's yes. the oil. Uh, any hardware store has chain oil. Okay. And you know what? All you're doing is doing the actual chain because it's like a bicycle chain, well, you know, you, how, you, how you oil a bicycle chain. Here, to me, this is one of the greatest innovations that I've ever seen on a chainsaw. My big chainsaws don't have this. Right. When I need the, the tension on the chain, is the secret to giving a good cut. Yes. And they always loosen up. That's normal, okay. you expect that. But what I have to do is I have to get a, a socket out, a screwdriver out, and it's, it's a pain yours. in the butt to do. With this, you flip this and you twist it. And that tightens it up. That's all 
tool free. Well, that guess what? is ingenious. Yeah, There's so 1300. We have a clean out department for all the mm -hmm. sawdust, right. and then we also have a chain tightener. What did you say? Well, we there's only 1300 remaining, and this is the season. Not only because I don't know about anybody else, but I got leaves there, or um, yeah. limbs, limbs, yep. and leaves everywhere, uh -huh. and I'm not going to get to to the next couple of weeks. Here's an opportunity. You own this. You're not renting it. You're not hiring anyone. And, you know, Woo. you'll be able to get everybody healthy in the world of trees around you and limbs and shrubs. It, it's also, it's easier to do your pruning now. There you go. Before yep. you've got a lot of coverage with leaves. Yep. It, you, this is the best time of year when you get a decent day when, you know, it's above 45 degrees. Yeah, there you go. I mean, to get out there and get the work done. Yeah, the only thing about this video that shows me is you should really cut right at the base of, at, at the tree. She's cutting like two inches out. Other right, than right, that, it's right. showing a beautiful cut, but it's showing you that all the independence that you would have with this. If it's not that big of a giant tree that fell, this is stuff you can clean up yourself yeah. without calling a tree surgeon. You can handle right, it way, yourself because it's lightweight. Do you know why they call themselves tree surgeons? No. So they can charge you more money. Ah, well, they've expensive. got a medical license. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Surgeon yeah. sounds a lot better than, you know. Yeah, um, tree I, hacker. Yeah. I yeah. saw him cut a piece of lumber. Could you do that? Yes, yes, I could. Out of the way, woman. I get to do this one. Okay, cool. Now, here's, here's the secret. Yeah, talk about the safety features. Yeah, yeah. I'm Every, still everything about this design is beautiful. If you notice this big back plate right here, okay? Mm -hmm. That big back plate is there to go ahead and rest up against whatever it is ah. that you're cutting. Yes. Because the whole idea of a chainsaw is you want to get the teeth back here at the back to make the initial cut. You don't want to cut like this because it'll bounce. So what you do is you turn it on and you turn it on with a safety switch here and then just a trigger, okay? So you fire it up and then you, you rest it and then you cut like this. You just go back. Woo! Now you notice how the chain guard automatically came up. Yep. You know, it's so seldom that I have sawdust at work. <laughs> this is no, a good and day. you know the best part is, you know, we, ha we built this whole um, tool shed in the back by our vegetable right? garden. But we wanted to do the work, and instead of getting out a circular saw, we just brought this back and did all the work. This isn't like a precision finish cut, but it's pretty darn well, nice. I'll tell you what. And, and we cut everything without having to go back to electricity. Right, right. Yeah. Or the, gasoline. For a circular okay, saw. Here's that the other so thing good. you guys have said. Yes. Beautiful. I That's think a really lot of good. us own a lot of your work. Yes. I yes. love that. I love my leaf blower. Yes. And I have multiple batteries. So they're, will this all... battery work? Yes. We have this works battery interchange situation that is so fantastic because yeah. if you already own our blower yeah. mulcher vac mm -hmm. or you know our you know any of our things which are so amazing and reliable, you can use any of the batteries. So if you have a big job and you already have batteries at home, my gosh, yeah, you can just go. go for hours. We got what, fewer than eleven hundred of these yeah. to go around. That's so it. So they're going quickly, and then when they're gone, you know it, it, if takes it a while. even comes back well, before the end of right. the year. You know what? Just when you really want to get out on a yeah. nice day, you're like, why? I get this thing. Mm -hmm. Get it now so you're ready. We're, we're kicking off our big lawn and garden. I know, on Thursday. Yeah. Woo! Uh, Pat and I are both excited to, to do that. Uh, here's your chance to shop a little bit early. And that's kind of like what Pat and I want to do I on Sunday it? mornings. Yeah. Is to show you the, the most popular items of last week, the things coming up for next week, and give you a chance to shop. This is a customer top rated item. Now, regular chainsaws, I'm not saying anything against them but you have to mix oil and water. You want to try it? They're just Could hard I? and they're no, intimidating. Yes. Pat, come on over. Do you want to right. do? I have never tried this before. Okay. So. You're just okay. going to rest it up. Don't do that okay. knot area, and, but do right okay. there. And let the saw do the work. Okay. That's good. Now, lift yes. it up just a little bit so that it's starting. No, so the blade isn't touching the wood yet. Oh, you okay. Want to, you want to start it okay. yeah, start without th pressure. Exactly. Start oh. it without touching. Okay. So there's right here. Uh -huh. This makes it safety. You're going to pull. In, oh, okay. And you're gonna, there you go. Now, hold it up against the wood. There you go. Now, did Fantastic. You notice, did you notice when you put this part <coughs> up against yes. the wood that it just, it almost guided itself? Yeah. It, do, it, 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 kinda, do it again. It, do it again. It's sort of, this time, turn it on. Okay. Before. Turn before. it on before you even you touch the wood. Nine, there 900. You there you go. Look at that. It's like butter. Oh my gosh! Isn't that I, you know satisfying? what? That is For so your birthday, I am buying you a blue ox. 
A, a what? Plot. It's a Paul Bunyan joke. Oh. <laughs> was... But here's the beauty of this. Read a little bit, people. Read. <laughs> ah. If and I told you this, I had and I told you this, I had a Christmas tree in the front that came up because I guess the ball wasn't rooted deep enough. Right. So what I did was, and I have something similar to this, is I took Sorry. it branch by branch by branch and took it apart myself because wow. I didn't want to hire somebody to do it. Yes. Or, right. And when you hire somebody to do it, what does that mean? It means you're spending a lot of money. Right. Yeah. So you have the freedom and ability to go do it yourself, I, battery I feel unarmed do it anywhere. Here. <laughs> you're, Dan's nervous about us. Okay. But yeah. here's that. Oh, go ahead. You're having fun. Oh, no, I have to go. Woo. Oh, that's right. You okay. go. You this got work is to just do. so satisfying because you can do it it's yourself. It's so lightweight. It's portable, battery one. up. Oh, I love her. She's the best. But we just cut so many pieces. Yeah. Clean up is a breeze, Dan, we, with this. We've got less than 800 pieces that are remaining. Uh, Thursday is going to be a busy day. I wouldn't wait on this. This is the perfect time of year to go ahead and get your gardens, your yards cleaned up of debris and limbs. It's good to see you. Oh my gosh, Thank it's you, Susan. so fun, Dan. Uh, Blue Ox, we, I thought you were gonna buy her like tree limbs or something. <laughs> We've had over 2,000 of the fur dozers 